This is fascinating. This past Sunday, I was speaking at a church, uh, a, a very middle-class suburban church outside of San Francisco. And I asked the congregation how many had heard the word gentrification. And I'm going to say, I want to say maybe 10% had heard that word. Uh, you guys are in the midst of it. You, you, you know what it is you're being impacted by it. What's your definition of it? The gentry are returning. The gentry are returning. Who are the gentry? People with money to buy homes. Yeah, yeah. And what else is happening? The yeah, the, rent, the rents go up and the folks uh, move out. New rules, yeah. Uh, it comes from the old English word gentry, which uh, when I, you know, I first heard that word when I was, uh, uh, I was, it was in high school that I was reading, it was a history class. It was European history. That's where I first heard that word gentry. The landed gentry is what they call them. The landed gentry. Those are the folks that owned the land in the 1500s in Europe. And it was the, a feudal system of government. Those toiling masses on the land were under the, the lordship of whoever owned it. That's where the word landlord comes from. Literally, the gentry were the lords of their land. And, and everything that was uh, produced on that land, the, the, the crops, the animals, the cottage industries, all of those proceeds went to benefit the gentry, and the poor remained very poor. Uh, and so they, they were the ruling class until about the 1600s, some very innovative fellows came up with uh, some machines that would, that would spin wool about 100 times faster than you could spin it on the spinning wheel in your cottage. And they came up with uh, these machines that would weave cloth, weave cloth about 100 times faster than you could weave it on a, on a loom in your cottage. And so they set up these machines along the rivers to power them, and folks started moving off the land to the cities for jobs in the factories, and the money started shifting to the industrialists. That was the industrial revolution. And so money shifted off the land into the industry in the city. The gentry uh, started to decline. Their wealth wasn't being produced on the land anymore. And over time, they just died out. And so the industrialists won the day. That's where the wealth shifted. And, and the... Uh, the gentry disappeared from history until uh, it was just kind of an unknown word other than, other than a history book until, until this moment in history. It's been resurrected and dusted off and recoined gentrification, the return of landowners into the city. And, uh, and it's changing everything. 